Hi everyone! In this video, you're going to find out if the Google IT Support Professional Certificate is worth it. My name is Lauren and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro fast. Let's get started. Google IT Support Professional Certificate is an entry-level certification offered by Google that covers IT support, troubleshooting, networking, and related skills to enable you to find an IT support job. The certification was created for individuals who have no IT experience or qualifications. According to Google, 82% of its IT certification graduates report a career impact within six months. Google partnered with Coursera to deliver the certification, and it can be completed within six months with less than 10 hours of study per week. From learning how to fix the most common computer problems to configuring wireless networks and handling customer support, you will develop skills that will make you ready to apply for entry-level IT support roles. Wherever there are computers, there will be problems related to software, hardware, networking, printing, data recovery, disaster management, and general support. According to data from the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment in the computer support sector is expected to grow 8% between 2019 and 2029, with an estimated 54,800 new job openings. According to Google, there are roughly 340,500 open jobs related to IT support, with an average salary of $50,800. According to Robert Half's IT salary report, help desk and IT support roles are deemed critical in the IT industry. The Google IT Support Professional Certification costs $39 per month via Coursera. You can easily complete the certification in six months of part-time study. The total cost of the certification would then be roughly $300. Google also offers needs-based financial assistance. Let's talk about the skills measured by the Google IT Support Professional Certification. The certification will teach you about installing different operating systems, the basics of data encryption, checking data logs, creating a networked environment, providing customer support, and much more. There are a total of five modules covered in the certification. Let's take a look at each module and its related content. Technical Support Fundamentals Computer Architecture Computer Architecture Overview Computer Hardware Basics CPU, RAM, Hard Disk, and BIOS Mobile Device Repair Assembling a Computer Operating Systems Remote Connection and SSH Virtual Machines Installing Windows Installing Linux and Networking The Bits and Bytes of Computer Networking The TCP IP 5-Layer Network Model Ethernet and MAC Addresses Networking Devices All About Layers Routing Tables IP Addresses DNS DHCP and Proxy Operating Systems and You Becoming a Power User GUIs and CLIs Permissions in Linux and Windows Linux Basics Mobile App Packages Windows Software Packages Linux Software Packages Disk Partitioning Windows Reading Process Information Linux reading process information, and mobile app management, system administration and IT infrastructure services, the cloud, IT infrastructure services, routine maintenance, the role of IT infrastructure services in system administration, types of IT infrastructure services, how do quick labs work, remote access revisited, configuring communication services, Configuring email services Configuring user productivity services Directory services and open LDAP IT security Defense against the digital dark arts Malware continued Network attacks Denial of service Client-side attacks Symmetric cryptography Symmetric encryption algorithms 
what a security engineer does, asymmetric cryptography, asymmetric encryption algorithms, LDAP, radius, Kerberos, TACAX, single sign-on, cryptography, symmetric cryptography, symmetric encryption algorithms, asymmetric cryptography, asymmetric encryption algorithms, and hashing algorithms. For a more complete curriculum, download the latest Google IT Support Professional Certificate Objectives located in the description area under this video. Now, let's look at the prerequisites for the Google IT Support Professional Certificate. There are no prerequisites or requirements for this certification. How to prepare for the Google IT Support Professional Certificate. Once you enroll in the certification, you will be able to access videos, handouts, supplemental reading, quizzes, assignments, and other material to get a deeper understanding of all the concepts covered in the certification. However, it's better to widen your resource pool and consider additional material to enhance your understanding of the technical concepts covered in the certification. Self-study resources. IT support is a vast domain with a strong community. You will be able to find many additional resources to help you prepare for the certification. Books. There are no officially recommended books for this certification. Therefore, if you want more depth and understanding of IT support concepts, you can consider books such as The IT Support Handbook, a how-to guide for providing effective help and support to IT users, A Plus Guide to IT Technical Support, Hardware and Software, and Building and Managing a World-Class IT Help Desk. Links to these three books can be found in the description area under this video. Video Training Coursera offers video tutorials for each module of the course. However, for a more in-depth understanding of the exam objectives, you can search each topic on YouTube for related videos. Instructor-led training. There is no in-person instructor-led training offered for this certification. However, you can enroll in Google's virtual workshops to seek more guidance on this certification and your career path. You can find a link to Google Virtual Workshops in the description area of this video. Practice Tests Coursera includes practice tests and activities as part of the Google IT Support Professional Certificate courses. Each of the five modules has several practice exercises. For example, you will get some practice exercises to refine your troubleshooting skills at the end of the first module. If you want to practice IT support and help desk questions, Try Test Dome, Wisdom Jobs, Pro Profs, and B-Skills. A link to these resources will be placed in the description area of this video. Practice Labs. The Coursera course provides you with practice tests, practical scenarios, quizzes, and practical assignments to enable you to develop your IT support skills. You can also try free online tools and websites like AWS Free Tier, GNS3 Free Tool, free Linux tutorials, VMware Labs, and Premium Exam Labs to get more practice. Links to these resources will be placed in the description area of this video. Now, let's look at what jobs you can get with the Google IT Support Professional Certificate. With a Google IT Support Certificate and some experience, you can apply for the following jobs. IT Specialist, Technical Support Specialist, Systems Analyst, Network Engineer, Help Desk Technician, IT Support Specialist, IT Technician, Computer User Specialist, and IT Assistant. Now, let's talk about how much money you can make with the Google IT Support Professional Certificate. According to Payscale, the average salary for IT Support Specialist roles is $50,506 US dollars. Let's see what other people think about this certification. Here are a few observations from successful Google IT Support Professional Certification holders in the industry. The Google IT Support Professional Certification was launched in 2018, and there are thousands of individuals who were able to make a successful transition into IT by passing this certification. Here are some comments from people who have passed the certification.
the truth about Google IT Support Professional Certificate. IT Support and Help Desk is one of the best ways to enter the IT industry, and the Google IT Support Professional Certificate is an excellent way to stand out and get a recruiter's attention. You can enter the IT industry with this certification and then make your way up to senior roles in different areas like cloud computing, programming, business intelligence, automation, and business analysis. Is the Google IT Support Professional Certification for you? This certificate is an ideal way to enter the IT industry if you have no IT experience or qualifications. The certification will introduce you to the world of IT and a new career. Based on your tastes and aptitude, you can then choose which area of the broader IT industry to focus on for your long-term career goals. Check out the video on the right to discover the top 10 tips and tricks to help you pass the Google IT Support Professional Certification Exam.